sir and stepdad here. Right now it is Father's Day. And I've been thinking, actually, about a few things that I would like to discuss due to the fact that I think they're important. Let's start off with the mother with Mother Day and Father's Day things. Now there are people out there that yes they do wish they would get get gifts on those days and there are some that would like some but don't get anything let's point out the fact that um like this year for me I did not get any physical items for Father's Day I am not upset about it I was just happy to be able to just kind of relax which I can point out things like if if you're a child and your parents are still around and I mean, and I, it doesn't matter your, their age. And if you don't have your own family, because your family will probably want you around during those events, the people that are, that have the parents that don't have something going on for, for their family or what have you, you should probably what you could do in lieu of actual physical gifts is cook them a meal do the things they normally do chore wise around the house and if you have a younger sibling and you're that their your parents still take care of well but if that they take care of and you're and you're old enough to be left on your own or and babysit watch over the young, your younger sibling and let your parents go out and have some time to themselves away from the house now I'm gonna go into the, into things about I, other things I realized when it comes to like physical gifts if you still want to do the physical gifts you probably should limit how many things you're willing to accept gifts for because you can overstretch yourself and people just don't know what you do want what kind of things you want and I'll admit I have overstretched myself on a lot of things I like to do so I not to I'm not gonna be upset if they give me something for so, one other project or some or collection I had of than what I really wanted or some I really want more wanted it's I just would be happy with my family remembering me on Father's Day and now I'm gonna go into my problem with projects I have overextended myself I have a lot of projects I've been trying to work on I mean I've been doing paracord YouTube social media in general um, Collection, collecting stuff. I mean, I mostly collect, like collecting the military equipment. But I got two cars I'm working on restoring. Survival tech, learning survival techniques, gardening, building stuff, making stuff out of paracord. I have overstretched myself. I mean, I have three day weekends, but I've got us sort I do feel like I need to sort out my priorities. 
I've been trying to work myself into a schedule where I work on this little thing, these things here, during these certain days, then other things on these certain days. I haven't gotten a rhythm down yet. And to be honest, yes, having a four year old can make trying to schedule things a bit difficult. And I try my best to work around it. And now that it's getting warmer, and I'm by warmer, I do mean warmer. It gets a little more difficult to do things. I have, and it, with so many projects, it does if each project is it gets affected by how much I have to do. And yes, it can be overwhelming. And I do keep trying to go on, and I recommend you do it. And in the words of General Patton, you are not beaten until you admit it. Hence, don't. I will see you next time.